this is the scrapbook. I'm out here in Miami. I have to get my lashes done to go back to school. I finished my first page in my journal or whatever. Like, why do I still have shirts in my Skims? I forgot I even had this. Welcome back to the channel. It's your girl Barbie K20 and for the freaking banger. And as you can see by the title of today's video, let me just show you the time. Because I'm up this morning, y'all. I am up and stuck. Look at the time. 6.03 Friday, July. I've been up for four minutes. I'm probably wondering why I got so much energy at 6 in the morning. I actually slept dumb good last night. I went to bed at like 7 p.m. Yesterday I was super productive and I went to bed right on time. But it's a new day and I'm like, let me get up super early. See what I could get done in a day. So that's what we're going to be doing this morning. I actually want to be very productive because if you know, you know. In about three weeks, I have some big life changes coming up. So I'm just trying to really prepare for that. Make sure I'm all set with that. Everything starts now. So it's 6 a.m. Um, I'm about to make a to-do list of everything I need to get done. I have a dermatologist appointment at 9.30. Besides that, I have a few other things I want to get done. I'm about to make a to-do list right now. So first thing I want to do is clean my room. I started cleaning it yesterday, but it's not a deep clean. Like, I need a deep clean of my room. Like, I want to clean the bathroom and vacuum and, like, wipe all my dressers and my vanity down and all that. So I got to clean my room. I want to take like a good shower probably like an hour long shower i'm gonna write good shower um what else do i'm gonna do today um i have to film my room tour today which is another reason why i need to um clean my room really well um what else what else oh i have to go to staples to print something today to send to my teacher so i can make up some assignments so i gotta do that i'm probably gonna do that on my way back from the dermatologist and then what else do i want to do oh i want to go through my clothes today and figure out what i'm going to give away and what i'm gonna keep because i have a lot of clothes that i don't even wear so i need to figure out what i'm gonna give away i also have to fold my clothes because i did my laundry but i didn't fold my clothes yeah i think that's really it y'all we'll see as we go throughout the video obviously i probably have more things to get done but it's early it's 6 a.m so i have time and y'all before we even get any further into the video we talk about my consistency like i know i'm only two days in but my goal from now until i go off to college is to post two i mean not post two post a video every two days on youtube so i already have my next five videos planned out and when i'm gonna edit them and when i'm gonna drop them so just a little pat on the back for the consistency because y'all know that's something that i kind of struggle with but i'm locking in now so yeah y'all we're up early it's 6 a.m i'm excited to film this video i'm excited to be productive for y'all so let's get right on with the video hey put your city up bitch just can't see me man i want something vibey this morning like i'm not trying to listen to no rap music right now let me take a pic to show my instagram that i'm actually on my shit yeah real consistent
Michael. go Even though it's salty Hate to see you with some other But know you happy Hate to see you happy If I'm not the one driving I'm so mature I'm so mature I'm so mature I got me a therapist To tell me there's other men I ain't doing one night And I just want you If I can't have you No one should I might I might kill my ex Not the best idea His new girlfriend's next How I get here I might kill my ex I did it all for us, oh. I did it all for us, oh. I did it all for love, I did it all of this on no drugs, I did all of this so 
you have dialed is not available at present. Please leave your message after the beep. Like a... Like a... So I just got back from my dermatologist appointment. I probably like, why was you putting on makeup to go to the dermatologist? I wasn't really going for like something with my face specifically. It was something else. I have a keloid on my ear. I'm not gonna show y'all cause it's mad embarrassing, but I went for that. So I could put makeup on cause there wasn't anything involved in my face. But y'all right now I'm about to do some things. I have this journal that I never wrote in and I also have if y'all watch my back to school video, which you should, I bought this planner. This is the planner and it's so cute. And we're about to do some journaling and some planning and all that. And I also want a scrapbook, but I don't know if I'm a scrapbook now or later. I might scrapbook later, but I'm going to show y'all everything. I'm going to show y'all the scrapbook and the planner and the journal and all that. Let's set my camera up. And y'all, let's get into today's beat though. Like yeah i tried something different with my lips and i really really like it so i think this is gonna be like my signature lip look or whatever so this is the planner y'all like i said if you see my back to school video you saw me buy this from target shit was like 27 dollars. it was like 26 90 something and i want to start writing in my planner because i'm going to college in three weeks y'all so i have to lock in these habits of you know planning out my days and sticking to it and all that so today you're about to write in this planner and i also have this journal this journal i got from staples it's just pink i want to get into journaling i'm not really sure where to start but we're gonna figure it out today together on camera because i'm really not sure where to start with journaling but i do want to get into journaling and just documenting my thoughts and everything like that because it's very important i know it's really good for your mental health and i just want to you know have like a diary or like keep a log of how my mental is going throughout the year so i can look back at it and stuff like that i feel like that'd be so cute so yeah i'm about to start journaling and then i'm gonna show you how the scrapbook that i bought i bought the scrapbook honestly a few months ago and i'm just now gonna use it but i'm gonna still show y'all because we're doing it today so this is the scrapbook it just has these ties where you can tie into like a cute bow tie it's really big it's pink of course i got this off amazon so if y'all want the link let me know oops it came with all types of like stickers and decals and just stencils and a whole bunch of stuff for the scrapbook and all the pages are pink so i'm not really sure how it's gonna go but we're gonna figure that out today and i also bought some colored are these pens or markers now these are markers yeah i got some colored markers to scrapbook with and i also have some photos that i printed out of just random memories like random random memories like this is me and brie right here out to eat what else we got and i printed out pictures of me to put in there too i know i printed out some stuff from miami this is me in miami I'm out here in Miami. So yeah, we're gonna see how that goes. But first I'm gonna start by writing in my planner and then we're gonna move on to the journaling and then move on to the scrapbooking. I'm supposed to help my mom or something later when she comes back home. So when she comes back home, I might have to pause and come back and pick up the camera. But either way, we're gonna get all three of these things done. So yeah, let's get started y'all. I'm really excited cause I've been putting this off for a minute and I'm just excited to write my planner and all that. Okay y'all, so these are my pens. I bought these in my in my back to school video also. So make sure y'all watch that. I'm gonna keep promoting it. I don't care what nobody say cause y'all need to watch that video. That video came out really good. And then here's another look at the planner. Super cute. The month of July is damn near over. So I think I'm gonna start just for the month of August to start fresh, you know. August starts in, August is next week. So yeah, we're gonna start planning for the month of August. July is damn near over. First page, I'm about to put my personal information, name, all that. I don't know what color I should write in. I'm leaning towards pink. I'm gonna write in pink. <laughs> Yeah, and it comes with stickers and stuff like that. That's so cute. Oh, it comes with check marks, hearts. I really love this, y'all. Okay, so we're gonna go to August. 
make setting yourself up for success a daily habit period so this is the month of august the month of august is a busy month for me because like i said i'm going to college and everything like that it's back to school season just a lot a lot a lot i'm launching my hair business like i got so much going on y'all so i'm gonna start with dates that i know for sure i have to put in so i know the 18th is move in day <laughs> the 17th i have a few appointments the 17th i have a dermatologist appointment and i have a dentist appointment y'all i have to get my lashes done for back to school like a week before i'm getting my lashes the 12th and i don't move into the 18th because she's going out of town so i have to get mega volume to make sure they last what else y'all what else Ooh, august 5th the saturday i'm going to a hosting and if y'all want a club hosting vlog to see how that goes whenever i go outside let me know down below so club hosting on the 5th at rum jungle I'm gonna put content that I want to drop in the color purple because we're gonna be color coding y'all so from jungle club hosting and then I'm gonna put um day in the life vlog club hosting to film Saturday and then the 18th moving day I'm filming a college moving what else what else my last appointment is 12 and that's when I'm starting my back to school maintenance vlog so what else do i have to get done y'all i don't really have any more set in stone dates i don't think for the month of august now i'm about to fill in my to-do list for the month of august so i'm gonna put move into college i'm just put move in what else i have to finish packing and i haven't even started packing any of my things up yet so i gotta do that I'm gonna put be consistent on YouTube. Ooh, I have to launch my hair business. So I move into college the 18th. I'm trying to figure out when I wanna launch my hair business and all that. Cause I wanna actually settle in and you know, get used to college life before I start on my hair business. I'm not gonna put a set date cause I'm not sure how everything's gonna go when I get down there, you know? I'm gonna just keep it here, launch hair business and then that'll remind me to get everything figured out for that. So this is all I got so far for the month of August, y'all. Obviously, like, as I figure out more, I'm gonna add more to it. But purple is content. Pink is like things I have to get done. And these are the only appointments I have scheduled so far. So I don't really have anything else to write like that. So I'm just thinking of what else I could add. I don't really know anything else to add. These are like the individual days. But for right now, I'm just focusing on the overall month. Y'all, look at how aesthetic I am. Like, I'm so freaking aesthetic. Follow my spam, bro. Okay, y'all, so now I'm gonna get into my journaling. I'm gonna put my name and all that first. y'all so starting in my journal i think i want to start by just writing a letter to god and then i'm going to write a letter to myself first i'm gonna just thank god for everything that i have so far everything i've accomplished all my success on youtube that i have so far i just want to sit down and say thank you before i talk about anything else because that's something that i got to do more often like show my gratitude being grateful you know being thankful and all that so i think i want to start by that you got to look back and show thanks if you're not grateful god's not going to bless you with more you know so i think i want to start by doing that and then after i write those two letters i think i'm gonna start by writing a letter to my future self i don't know how like y'all this is my first time ever journaling literally my first time in my life so bear with me y'all i'm not really a pro at this i don't know where to start so i'm just doing my best i might blur out the words because it's kind of like you know personal to me yeah let's get into the journaling so y'all as i'm editing this video i'm on like day four of consistently journaling and I just wanted to come on here and tell you guys how beneficial it's been to me. I feel like it's a space for me to get all my thoughts out. I'm used to keeping my thoughts inside, so I'm really enjoying journaling lately. And I'm glad that I was able to share my first time ever journaling on camera with you guys. I had to blur it because it's kind of personal to me, but I 100% recommend journaling for you guys. Like, if y'all want more journaling content or see how that's going for me, let me know down below because I loved it. Alright, 
y'all so i just finished my first page in my journal or whatever and even though i'm only one page into journaling that was very therapeutic y'all like i'm not even about to lie to you i really enjoyed that i really enjoyed that like for real i was able to just let all my thoughts out and write a note to god and basically say everything i wanted to say like i don't know other people who are you know like more secure in their faith do that like write notes to god but i think i'm gonna start doing that um a few times a week because I really enjoyed that. I feel like I was talking to him, you know? And that's something I want to work on this year. Just working on my faith and just doing better with that in general, you know? I want to do better. So I feel like this is a really good start. And I really, really enjoyed that. So yeah, that was fun. That was fun, y'all. My camera did die, I think, like halfway through. But it's okay because I'm probably going to blur out the words anyways. Because like I said, this is kind of like personal. To be putting on the internet like that. So my handwriting is very aesthetic. I probably can't even read it right now, but... You see how everything's just so uniform? Like, I'm really that girl when it comes to the handwriting. But yeah, I really enjoyed that, y'all. And I think I'm gonna come back and journal a little bit more later and write the letter to myself next. But I had to write a letter to God before anything. Yeah, I'm gonna come back to you guys in a bit so we can scrapbook. All right, y'all, so I'm back, but I decided I'm not gonna scrapbook today because I was going through the pictures that I have. I was going through the pictures that I have for the scrapbook and they're not really like scrapbook material. Like, and I don't feel like it's gonna come out the way I want it to with these pictures. So I'm gonna go to CVS and print more pictures. Not today, but some other time. Like I mostly did selfies of myself. Like why did I print so many selfies? It's not gonna give the look that I want it to give. It's a whole bunch of pictures of myself, y'all. So I'm gonna hold off on the scrapbooking because I want it to come out like super, super cute and girly and it just won't be given that. And I changed my phone case, y'all. I like this case. I been had this case, but I never wore it because it's like not protective at all and I don't have no screen protector. But also on my list today, I have to sort out my clothes because y'all know I'm about to be moving soon and I have a bunch of clothes that I don't wear. Like I have two whole drawers of clothes that I never even open. So I'm about to go through my clothes right now and my bed, it has like drawers underneath my bed so that's where i keep most of my clothes so i'm gonna set y'all up right now and we're about to go through my clothes y'all i think i'm gonna end up throwing away a lot a lot of stuff all right y'all i'm gonna just put my comforter up a little bit so i can see the drawer and this is the drawer y'all you see how i can't even open because there's so many clothes in here like these clothes i just don't wear so i'm about to go through them i'm gonna put clothes i'm gonna keep on this side and clothes i'm gonna throw away on this side Inside your heart, is there any room for me? I won't have to hold my breath till you get down on my knee because you only want to hold me when I'm like, why do I still have shirts from high school? I graduated in 2021, y'all. All right, y'all, I did my first drawer and I got my pile of clothes. I'm gonna throw away now. I'm about to go to the second drawer. One day you disappear Oh, this is a whole Waiterman skirt set that I never even wore. Tripping. Look at this. Skims? I forgot I even had this. Y'all, this is why you don't put skims in the wash. Because look, I done tore my skims up. Sheen clothes still in the packaging. I gotta try some of this on to see if it's even cute, bro. Yeah, all this Sheen stuff, I gotta try it on. I shouldn't. So I tell him it's one of me. He make it fun of me. His girl is a bum to me. Like that boy is a cap. Saying he home, but I know where he at. Like, but he blowing her back. Think about me, cause you know that it's fat. And it been what it been. Pulling his phone like you'll send me a pen. Look at my shit, cause he know what I'm on. But when he hit me, I'm not gonna respond. But I don't sleep enough without you. And I can't eat enough without you. If you don't speak, does that mean we're through? Don't like sneaky shit that you do. Alright, y'all, 
so I just went through my clothes as y'all saw that actually took like two seconds I was really quick now I'm trying to figure out what else I want to do for the rest of the day because I was supposed to go to Staples to print something on a scanner but I actually have a scanner at home that I forgot about so I don't gotta go to Staples to do that I'm trying to think anything else I have to get done this morning y'all it's about like um 1130 now so the morning's just about over I was pretty productive though I cleaned my room I journaled I cleaned my bathroom I organized my clothes like I said I wanted to only thing I didn't do was fold my clothes but I'm gonna wait to do that because I just put in another load of laundry so I'm not gonna fold my clothes until that that load is done so I think I'm gonna wrap up the video here I hope you guys enjoyed it my 6 a.m morning routine I'm not gonna lie y'all I am getting a little bit sleepy now that it's about noon so I might take a quick little nap today but I'll sleep better knowing that I spent my morning being productive and y'all got to see me do that so hope y'all enjoyed the video if y'all want more morning type videos because I'll be picking up early some days like out the blue if you want more content like this let me know and I'll see y'all in my next video bye y'all